Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Timmy Treacle, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And my final movie review today is called Bloodshot. Now this movie was released on March 24th, 2020. And it is a superhero film that received mixed reviews from critics and fans. On a CinemaScore, it has an average grade of a B. It has a 5.7 out of 10 on IMDb, a 30% on Rotten Tomatoes, and 85% on Google. On a $45 million budget, it made $29.2 million at the box office and a limited release due to the effects of the uh, coronavirus uh, pandemic. Um, this movie definitely would have made a lot more money had it made its natural run through the uh, box office. Uh, both uh, at home and uh, worldwide. But the movie was directed by David S.F. Wilson and direct, uh, written by Jeff Wadlow and Eric Heisler. And the movie stars Vin Diesel, Sam uh, Hunan, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, uh, Isaac Gonzalez, Toby Kebbell, and Guy Pierce. And this movie is about... Uh, Ray Garrison, uh, played by Vin Diesel, who his, him and his wife are killed, and he is brought back to life as a super soldier by scientists. Um, and while he's been brought back, uh, he's been brought back indestructible, and his new name is called Bloodshot. And this movie is based off the uh, best-selling comic book as well. Um, while Bloodshot is learning the ropes from other super soldiers, he starts to get uh, his memory back and remembers who is responsible for killing him and his wife. And he sets out on his own to try and find this person and put an end to him. But as he sets out uh, to do that, he realizes that there is more to him than meets the eye. There's um, a lot more conspiracy uh, and things going on that he's not aware of. And uh, yeah, that's what this movie is about. Uh, I knew nothing about the comic book. Um, didn't even know this was going to be based on a comic book. I just thought it was going to be another action movie. Um, kind of like a Robocop, you know, indestructible. But uh, yeah, I, I love the characters in this movie. Uh, the action scenes, the special effects were on point. Especially when they're showing uh, Bloodshot. Um, but, uh, yeah, I love the other characters. I really feel for his character uh, losing his wife and everything. And, uh, yeah, I, I enjoyed the fight scenes. The action scenes were really good as well. And it was just a lot of fun. I had a blast uh, watching this movie. And uh, I definitely recommend you check it out if you haven't already seen it. Um, I really hope we get uh, a franchise out of this, maybe at least a trilogy, um, possibly with some DVD, Blu-ray sales, and rentals. Maybe it'll uh, make its money back, which I hope it does. Uh, it, it sucks that this uh, pandemic had to go on. Uh, if we actually had an intelligent president, uh, we could have got a, a, a in front of this thing. Uh, but as usual, he takes nothing seriously. Uh, but yeah, getting back to Bloodshot, I enjoyed this movie. And uh, it definitely deserves um, uh, more positive reviews than what it's been getting. But to each their own, we all have our own likes and dislikes. This is one of my favorites, and I really hope we get to see more of Bloodshot and some of the other characters uh, that we had in this movie. So I'm going to give Bloodshot a 9 out of 10 and two thumbs up. So definitely check this movie out. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, in the comment section below, if you've seen it, give me your thoughts and opinions. And did you think it was good, bad, overrated, underrated? Let's have a great discussion about this movie. And uh, do you think it deserves a sequel? Let me know that in the comment section below as well. Uh, and as always, if you're new to the channel, subscribe today for more content. If you like this review, hit that like button and uh, share this review on your social media as you see fit to. Uh, and uh, let's try and help me reach my goal of 1,000 subscribers 
by the end of the year. I would love it uh, to reach that mark. Um, I appreciate all the love and support I get from you guys. You guys watch my videos. Uh, and uh, yeah, so yeah, let's have some feedback. Let's have a great discussion about this. And if there's ever a top 10 ranking or movie review you want me to do, uh, let me know in the comment section below, and I will definitely do that for you. Uh, if I haven't seen the movie, um, uh, I will definitely watch it and review it for you as soon as I can. And I will definitely give you a shout out too if you uh, do request a movie review top 10 or ranked. So, but thank you guys for watching, and check you later.